Hello guys, it's Cabrexel Gaming here, and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be showing you how to install your GTA 5 disc. So basically, what you want to do with your Xbox is, is just grab your install disc, put it in, play it like normal, and it will load it up like. Uh, and then for you to install it, which is what I'm going to do now. You guys to watch. So. I'm like, okay, and then it'll probably ask me for an, you know, a device. So, click OK. Click on my hard drive. And, as you can see, it's 7,876 MB megabyte. So, you know, it shouldn't take that long. So, I may, I may just keep this running. For you guys to watch how long it's going to take. Uh, so, you know, it looks to be doing it pretty quick. And while it's doing it, it's showing you some screenshots, which is pretty epic. I must admit. So, you know, we're already on 247 now. So, again. Okay. Uh, we've got the vine wood siren there. We've got uh, the nice geeky looking guy. But, like, does all the highs from that. It's like the brains of behind it all. We've got Trevor. Not Trevor, I keep getting them mixed up. We've got uh, Franklin here. Uh, I don't know what gun that is. Um, we, I think this is Franklin under that face paint. Not that sure. <laughs> I don't think it is though. We've got, we've got dreadlocks. There's Michael. Who oh, else we got? FBI L F I B So yeah that's pretty much how you install it. Uh you know we just got to wait for it to install now. And once it's installed you can go into your play disc but do not install that one because it will I've heard will create a lot of lag. So don't go on that one guys. Uh, you know, you don't want the lag to happen in your game and then your missions are not gonna, you know, no, not like load or anything. Just gonna lag it out. So we've got Trevor here with the sniper rifle and the quad. A dip. Quad or whatever. So if you don't know where I'm looking at, you can see in the right bottom corner installing and it shows you what it's got to do now it says here 7876 MB but I it takes a gigabyte up so I'm not so sure about this uh, so we'll have to wait and see You know it's gonna like take about roughly about 20 minutes. You later see that guy in a wheelchair or you know with a walking stick as I just saw there. So you know if you're watching this video and you haven't watched my unboxing video, then don't forget to check that out. It's kind of awesome. You know you might show interest. You know, even though you've already got it, so... We're on 2,000 now. We're on 5,000 to go. So it's actually going pretty quick. I don't know if it's like another installing part after this one, but... You know, we'll have to wait and see. I don't know who that guy is. Unless it's like a customization of Trevor, but 
I didn't want that guy up. No, you got the bulletproof vest, what he's showing you now. Got three bullets in there. LSD S behind there. FIB again. We've got Franklin here with Chop. And baseball bat. And of course, the girl we saw in the first few screenshots with a police officer. Not long left to go now. So I will be doing a review in about a week's time uh, after being playing on the on the campaign. Because uh, the GTA 5 multiplayer doesn't come out till the 1st of October. So I will be waiting for that. And, um, you know, it should be right. It's, true. it's not that long. Uh, you know, uh, we've already waited this long. So I might as well wait till GTA 5 online. So I will be bringing some uh, footage out. Uh, I will be doing some on solo. But, uh,. I do believe you've got to take the cutscenes out or something like that. So, you know, that's what I'm going to do, I think. So, 3,000. So, you know, if this is only... The only installation you do, then you're probably okay. It's not going to take that long. You can upload it to USB. Well, install it to USB. That's what I'll I know I've got space, but. So from what when I started it, uh, you can see what time I started it there, uh, and then you can you know say how long it takes you, and then give it a comment, and then you know you can kind of compare and give other people how long it's gonna take them. You know if they like haven't picked it up from the store yet. You know, I've got the. Uh, the collector's edition so you know I got the 950 error cap or snap back if you like and also the deposit bag uh, with the key, the logo key and I am loving the blueprint map which is now up on my wall and it looks epic so you know if you've got yours up there then rock it out bit more longer, near that 4,000 and then just near 3,000 to go you know, I just thought I'd stay here talk to you a bit and wait for this to kinda install Four 
normally it probably would take about 20 minutes at max I mean that's only I think it took me uh, but yeah when uh, GTA 5 online does come out it's going to be so much awesome because then you're going to have to be able to play with all your friends and you know you're going to enjoy it more and even when you finish this, uh, uh, like, this whole campaign there's still like lots of stuff to do so I will, bring, I will be bringing a, another video out probably after this video maybe of some of the cheats uh, we have got uh, probably going on solo first, the solo campaign, and then after that, I'll be doing that. So, take a look out for that, and you know, subscribe if you are new. Uh, you know, that'd be awesome. Probably can just aim my chair there. <laughs> So now you're just waiting for your install now so it's pretty much you've done and it should be installing now if you did not install then just clear your catch from your devices you know your storage places and you should be okay but if not uh, then that's kind of really weird if it's brand new you know what I mean you've got no scratches on it or anything so you shouldn't have a problem there uh, at least you shouldn't have uh, but if you have then you need to, uh, I don't know, if it, if it's really bad as a scratch and you haven't took care of it, uh, I would recommend buying a new one. <laughs> but I doubt anyone has done that because we have been waiting about five years, nearly five years now, into this year. So we're at 6,000 now, so another 1,876. Just a little longer. I mean, if you have, uh, you know, stopped behind and then uh, watched how long it took, then thanks. You know, this does take quite a bit of time, depending how long the video is to upload. So, you know, it's 1080p as well. So, you know, just take it a little longer than normal. So I just thought I'd get a tutorial out there so then other people know what they need to do and not install the wrong disc. You know, it does say number one install disc on the Xbox, but for PS3, which I should be really talking about, because it's Blu-ray, well I believe it because it's Blu-ray, it is Blu-ray PS3, uh, that's why you don't need the extra disc, because that it can run it, if you get me, because uh, it's Blu-ray. We have, for Xbox, I haven't got a Blu-ray yet, till the Xbox One, uh, you know, it's going to be a lot better then. So, we're just going up to 7,000 now. So, I think what it will do, happen then, it will just go back to the dashboard. I'm not so sure. So I'm nearly there now. It's probably ch not even took 50 a minute. At least it doesn't feel like it if it has. So you know, it's not as like long as you know installation that would normally be like that. So 
I don't know, there might be another one yet. But if, it, if there is another one, then I'm going to stop it at here. You know, just so you know which uh, how long this goes on for. But I'm, I'm pretty sure there's only one. You've probably seen these like screenshots a lot of times now. <laughs> Just keeps going past. Almost there. Let's see what happens. Nearly there, guys. 55, 61, 68, 76. There we go. We have reached it. Loading story mode. Please insert disc 2. So, I'm going to take my disc out now. That will stay on. Which I've just found out. Then you want to get your other play disc. My disc tray is not even opening now. <laughs> it's going to open. There we go. After quite a while of doing that, didn't know why it was uh, not opening there. I think it might be a, a uh, my disk drive getting stuck because I've got the arcade still. So it says here loading story mode. So that is probably it now. It's installed, and you can just play the you know the play disc. So I've got a display here what you want the display to be like so you can change it if you want it darker go lighter and then you know it keeps loading up so yeah thanks for watching guys and I'll see you later bye bye